Hello Year 9, I know some of you are working on this task today because you will need to get it done by the end of today and I know there are some difficulties with it so I'm just going to go through a couple of very quick examples for you and um, hopefully this will make it nice and easy. Um, so the first question I am going to explore um, is we've got as an estimation we are told five miles is eight kilometres and we are asked to convert 7.5 miles into kilometers. So I need to work out what it is in kilometers. Now, the key thing here is the relationship between this number and this one will be the same as that one. So I need to work out what do I times five by to get to 7.5, okay? And to do that, I can use my calculator. And if I wanna know what five times something is 7.5, if I do 7.5, divided by five, it will give me what I would need to times it by. So that's multiplying by 1.5. So I'm gonna to have to do the same thing over here. And I'm gonna to have to do eight times 1.5, which is 12. Okay, so, oh, kilometers, sorry. So 7.5 miles is 12 kilometers. I'm gonna do another one and I'm gonna keep that one at the top there so you can see it. So my next one is, I've got the same thing again. I've got it's five miles is eight kilometers. And I've been asked to convert uh, 60 kilometers into miles. Same thing again, the relationship here has got to be the same as that. So I've got to work out what do I multiply eight by to get to 60? And to do that, use my calculator. And because I'm working out what would I do eight times something is 60. If I do 60 divided by eight, I will get what that something is and it's 7.5. So I'm gonna have to times this by 7.5 as well. And five times 7.5 is 37. 0.5 miles. Okay, just going to do one more example very quickly. Slightly different this one because we're actually asked about money. So we're told as an estimation, we are told that three pounds is roughly uh, four euros. And we asked, asked to convert uh, 10 pounds 50 into euros. And just the same, the relationship here has got to be the same as there. So I've got to work out what would I times three by to get to £10.50. And to do that, I'm gonna get my calculator and do £10.50 divided by three, which is 3.5. So I'm gonna to have to times this by 3.5 as well. And four times 3.5 is 14. So ooh, I'll make sure I use the right color. That is 14 euros. Okay, I hope that's helpful. Um, I always go about it in this strategy and it does help and just makes it a lot clearer for me. So do use this strategy if you think this is easier than whatever Mr. Hegarty is doing. Okay, I hope that helps girls, good luck.